Dominate or die. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Oh crap. I'm just getting sucked in. <laughs> He's down, the other guy's down. All right, we're good. I, I guess they're going for the top guys now. I'll just wait here. Anytime now. Dude. Finally. Oh, you went for the bottom guys. That That's cheap. That is cheap. Ow. Get away from me. And now, finally, they're going for the top guys. Let's go. Come on. Let's get the show on the road. The hell are you waiting for? Thank you. Ah, mind fuck. Let me not talk about mind fuck cuz uh a certain friend gave me a certain type of uh manga. Okay, we get to fight this guy. All right. I, I thought we just have to like break a device and then he's done. But anyway, um, I can't say mindfuck anymore because a friend of mine gave me a link to a certain website that shows a particular type of manga at a particular type of genre that, um, the category was mindfuck and yeah, I, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I mean, you guys already know where I'm going with this, so I don't really don't have to say it. If not, then try to search up mindfuck manga. Yeah, try searching up that. I do not condone this. <laughs> Let's just point that out. Sweet Jesus, now now that manga's all over my head now. Fuck. I can't get it out of my head. Where is he? I can't see through all this blood. Ah, crap. Again with the ghostly dumbass over here. Get over here. Ow. You know what's funny? Um, I don't use my base. No, when was the last time I've used my base? Jesus, this is probably when I first got the DLC. Yeah, ef ever since that, I don't use my base. In fact, you would be shocked on how much items I have that I've never used. Yeah, I I'll show it to you guys later. Once I beat this guy, fuck. There's also another DLC that I don't use. Um, I'm trying to remember. There was the base one, which, to be honest, I thought that was a waste of $10, to me, personally. Especially since I don't play PvP on the base mode. Yeah, that's just me. Which is another reason why you haven't seen my base in this one. Yeah, because um, I, I really don't do bases. I don't know, it just looks boring to me. Okay, um, let me delete that. What do I get? A mirror, I think. Rod back in his own head. Strikers should return get that. to normal. I'll make sure they use a mental get nullification that. shield for the rest of his stay. Get that. You just I get that. That's about it. Of and I get that. Thanks. Alright, these are the items that I have. Look. Yeah. That's what I have. All of that, and I have never used any of them. Just any of them. <laughs> I remember when I first showed this to a friend of mine, he wanted to slap me because he's like, dude, dude, the fuck? <laughs> like, I don't know, I mean, what's so important about bases anyway, besides the fact that you get the um, dropout, the sidekick, you know, the, the other stuff, the goodies, I would say. But other than that, I don't know. I kind of wasted 10 bucks on it, because I don't even use that DLC. 
I mean, the last time I went to my base was, what, like, two months ago? And that was because I wanted to see what my base even looks like in the first place, because it's been a while. And then I quit the game. <laughs> when I came back, I spawned in my base. Oh, man. But yeah, that shows how much I don't use my base. Alright, um, I got time for one more. Yeah, might as well do it. My friend has logged in. Oh, sweet Jesus. Hallelujah, my friend has logged in. Now we're going to do Coastal City. Get ready. I'll see you guys when it's ready. Well, that was fast. To be honest, I wished I have done Costa City first. Seems to me it's the mo one of the most popular ones of the alerts, because people want to do that, like... Wait, hold on, I didn't do the snap. Oh, come on. Oh, come on! Oh, fuck you, fingers. <laughs> but you know what I mean. People come in there very quick. When somebody's talking. They can't hear me. Nope, they can't. Which, in a way, that's a good thing, but at the same time, it's kind of a bad thing. Oh, wait, I was about to return to the last location. Oh, shit. Star Lab scientists were working on the fear capacitors when they were attacked by crazed members of the Sinestro. Uh, I can't. Find fuck, the fuck, so fuck. They won't let me. There we go. I'm sorry, group. Um, if you see this, it's nothing personal, but I, I really don't want to hear your voices right now. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> Hold on. I'm almost done. All right. That's better. No, it's nothing personal. I just don't want your voice to, um... Oh, he left. How tragic. And how quickly, too. <laughs> Hold on. I'll, I'll vote yes. There we go. You know what I sometimes hate when I play multiplayer games and there's somebody talking, right? But he's not talking to you. But, and he's not talking to anybody in the group. He's just talking to somebody that's in his house. Which makes me wonder, what the hell is the whole point of you having a mic if you're not going to talk to anybody? Seriously, he doesn't talk to anybody. He just stands there. Well, not stands there. He actually plays the game. But he just... He just talks only with his friend. And to me, that's kind of annoying because let's say if I'm trying to communicate with him, I can't because I can't tell if he's talking to me or he's talking to somebody in the room. Right? Which... Let me just say, if I'm talking in a video game, that's a very rare occasion, especially if I'm by myself. I'm just saying. Wait. Don't get that yet. Let me clear them out first. Ow. Okay. Let me get that. So we gotta bring this over here and destroy the... Not the Avatar of Fear, I think he's the... The lantern that is most affected by fear, I I think. Not Sinestro, it's just somebody else. I forgot what's his name. Alright, since we're doing this and it's pretty much going to take a while, I think right now is a good time to just chat. Is is the... You know, is the matchmaking still going? Oh, that sucks. Nobody's wanna, wanting to come. Alright. But, eh, I'm, I don't have a problem with it. Oh, my friend logged out. Eh. Well... Maybe he's going for dinner or something. I don't know. Just food for thought. Oh! I threw it to somebody and they did damage. That was funny. Um, anyway. Don't pick that up, you fucking idiot. Well, there's somebody down there. That's good. Dude, dude, do something. Do something. Uh, he's not doing anything. God, fuck. I don't want to kick him. Oh, for a minute there, I thought he was our healer, but no, he's a DPS. I, I can kick him if I wanted to. He's eh, he's not doing anything, but now he's moving, so that's good. Um, what was I gonna say? What was I gonna say? Okay, now's a good time for me to chat with you guys about this comment I received 
I'm thinking my Teen Titans review. And it was somebody who plans on giving up comics as a whole, saying that it was boring and it's time to pass the torch to the younger audience. Now, if you're watching this, try to understand. There are other comics besides DC or Marvel. I am actually getting sick and tired of hearing people talk about comics in general, but only mention DC and or Marvel. Hold on a minute. We need to protect the devices while the Star Lab scientists bring them online. Okay, we gotta protect them, that's fine. But anyway, I am getting sick and tired of people talking about comics in general, but only mention DC or Marvel. Hello, people! There's Image Comics, there's Boom Studios, there's Dynamic... Not Dynamic. Dynamite Entertainment, there's Dark Horse Comics, there's IDW Publishing... There's so many comic book companies that people just ignore. I, I'm kind of getting tired of it. I remember I watched this one video where this guy was talking about um, DC Origins. Now, I have no hatred towards the guy. He is a phenomenal YouTuber. In fact, I love his videos. And I love the advice that he gives in the videos and the stuff that he does. But to be honest, in this video, he mentioned that, oh, Origin doesn't matter. But he only mentions DC and Marvel. And now... It's not that I don't disagree with him, but actually, no, I agree with him. Origin doesn't matter if he's only talking about DC and or Marvel, which in a way he was, but he mentioned comics instead of DC and or Marvel. And that kind of ticked me off because I've been hearing that a lot and it, I don't know. It's just seriously, DC and Marvel is not comics. They're just two companies that publish comics. You might as well just say Disney is cartoons. That's not true. Come on, guys. Seriously, stop being so generalistic. But anyway, it's to the guy who mentioned that or who posted that comment. Um, you want to give up comics. That's fine. Fine. I mean, I'm not going to force you or anything. But since from what it seems like you only try DC or Marvel, try other comics. I mean, for God's sakes, there is... Hold on a second. Oh, this guy left the group. I didn't even know he joined. Sorry, I'm just listening to Oracle and, you know, having you guys to listen that way you're not confused over what's going on in this alert. But anyway, look, there, there is so many comics in Image. In fact, I, I'm going to be real honest with you guys. I read more Image comics than DC and Marvel combined. And that says a lot. It says a fucking lot. There is a perifla of good comics from Image. There is a lot of comics that I read from Dynamite. There is some that I read from Boom Studios. I really wish they were to push out more comics instead of just comics from cartoon shows. Because right now they only have regular show. Um... What was it? Adventure Time. They do have originals like the last broadcast. Um, what was the other one? I forgot the name. But yeah, there's Boom Studios. There's um, fuck. You may have prevailed. There's like I said. There's just a perifla of places or comics you can go. You don't have to restrict yourself to Marvel or DC. In fact, 